open distillery uh, built in 1794, which makes it one of the oldest distilleries in Scotland. So single means uh, that it's been produced in one distillery and one distillery only. And malt means that you use malted barley. Yeah? Because to, to make Scottish single malt, you're only allowed to use three ingredients. And you have to stick with them three ingredients. And that's water, barley, and yeast. So that's it. Now, so the first process is the malting process. What we're going to do first is we're going to soak this barley into water for four or five days. Right. Now after those five days, we stop that process again by drying the barley. And we're going to dry the barley above a big fire. Now that fire, you can throw a little bit of this. Basically the more peat you're going to throw into that fire to dry the barley, the more smoky whisk will be. We're going to take this barley, this malted barley, to the mill room. In the mill room we find the mill, and the main job of the mill is to crush that malted barley. We're going to break that malted barley open. And this is what we call the grist. Now we've got three parts sitting in this grist, we've got a bit of husk, we've got a lot of grit, and then we've got some flour as well, you can see the white bits in there. We're going to take the grist to the, to the mash house, and the process is called mashing. We've got to fill the wash back with about 35,000 litres of wort, and then we've got to inject about 300 litres of distiller yeast. Now as soon as you add that yeast to that wort, uh, you'll produce alcohol, the fermentation will start. Now, so what we're going to do in the distillation process, we're going to try and separate the alcohol from uh, that beer, from that wash. And how we're going to do that? Well, evaporation is going to help us do that. And what we get then is the new make spirit. The new make spirit is going to be our whiskey in 14 years. That's the stuff that we're going to fill the cask with, the barrels with, and we're going to mature it to 14 years. And that will be our open 14 then. Now the first one you got in front of you, the open 14, that's quite straightforward, pretty easy. That's been maturing for 14 years in that white American Oak X bourbon cask. Yeah, and that's it. I think the Open 14 is a very smooth whiskey. It's, you've got some orangey, fruity flavours in it, and it's just like a slightly smoky finish, uh, but quite gentle in general, I think. Yeah. If you go to the one next to it, the Distillers Edition, the Distillers Edition is basically an Open 14 with an extra year in a sherry cask. The sherry cask is European red oak, and it contains Spanish sherry, sherry Montefiore to be accurate. Then the third one, the open little bay, this is what we call a cask marriage. Because uh, in, instead of swapping casks, we're going to mix casks together. Then the fourth one you got in the stave, our distillers. And instead of 43%, this one's 48. That's a, a, earlier on, so it's a bit stronger. Now you wouldn't say so, because I think this, the, 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 the flavour or the taste is quite light and floral, I would say. And the other chose eight different distilleries to make a special Game of Thrones edition and we've got the Night's Watch, yeah? we've got Jon Snow, we won. Yes. <laughs> Flavour wise, um, it's, I'm going to say it's in between the Distillers edition and the Little Bay to give you an idea. Again, a lot of sherry influence in this, rich full body whiskey um, and again it's 43% alcohol by volume. Yeah. And then last but not least, our Old Teddy or the McLean's bottle. Old Teddy started here in 1953 as a stillman or an operator. His son, young Teddy, started here in the 80s, and now his grandson, not mini Teddy or junior Teddy, his name is actually just Derek. <laughs> uh, Derek is gonna get his bottle as well in a few years. Um, and what it is for this one, again, it's a cask marriage of normal bourbon cask and then ex bodega casks. And I think this is the perfect example of that you can make a beautiful, a stunning whiskey without it being 20 odd years old, because this is only 12 years old. Right? They made this one 12 years old, this is actually a nice little touch, they made this one 12 years old because old Teddy back in his days, he used to make open 12 instead of open 14. So to honor him they made this one 12 years old.